This video is an initial setup guide covering all required settings for the Cronus Zen Apex Legends Pro Game Pack for the PlayStation and Xbox versions of Apex Legends. If you find this tutorial helpful, feel free to share it and leave a like. For simplicity, we will only be mentioning buttons for PS4 and Xbox One, but you can find the equivalent buttons for other controllers in the controller conversion table here. To open the Game Pack configuration menu on the OLED display, hold touchpad and options together on PlayStation, or hold view and menu together on Xbox until you feel a rumble. This menu gives you access to all of the Game Pack's adjustables and mods. You can navigate between settings using the left and right bumpers and adjust them by using the D-pad. For listed options, use down and up. And for numeric values, use left and right. Certain settings contain additional options that are related when you press cross on PlayStation or A on Xbox. For example, when you are selected on button layout, you can enter the adjustment menu to set up your stick layout, sensitivity, and other related settings. To go back, tap circle on PlayStation or B on Xbox. Before using the game pack, you will need to match certain settings with your in-game settings. First, make sure that your vibration settings are on, both in-game and in your console's menu settings. Next, make sure that your in-game response curve is set to classic and your look dead zone is set to small. Match your button layout. Choose between default, bumper jumper, button puncher, evolved, grenadier, ninja, and customized. Now, enter the adjustment menu and match your stick layout. Match your sensitivity and then match your sensitivity for ADS. If you have set your in-game inverted look to inverted, then you will need to set your anti-recoil mode to inverted ADS anti-recoil. Otherwise, leave it on ADS anti-recoil. If you selected customized as your button layout, you will need to match each of the following. Jump, crouch, interact slash pickup slash reload, cycle weapon slash holster on hold, aim down sights on hold, attack, tactical ability, ping slash ping wheel on hold, sprint, melee, use health slash shield kit, and finally, equip grenade. Most custom controller configurations are supported. However, touchpad or view is vital for toggling mods and must be kept bound to the default in-game function, the map button. Go back to the button layout screen, then navigate over to the featured legend setting. Make sure that you match this setting with the legend that you are currently playing as. Now that everything has been set up, you can exit the menu, tap circle on PlayStation or B on Xbox until you see the save changes screen. Now while selecting save, tap cross on PlayStation or A on Xbox. You will see a prompt confirming that your settings have been saved. If you select don't save, you will not see a confirmation prompt and your changes will be reverted. You are now ready to use the Cronus Zen Apex Legends Pro Game Pack. For more information on other features available in the game pack, such as profile switch mode, weapon selector pro, and more, check out our other videos. For more helpful videos and to keep up to date with the latest news, hit that notification bell and don't forget to subscribe to the Cronus Zen YouTube channel.